Hi everyone, it's Mandy Schneider here on week 10. I got it done and I was so excited. I loved how it turned out. So I can't wait to show you what I did. So while I'm doing this, I wanted to tell you guys that I was telling my, my good friend who I run with that about my problem with finishing stories that I that I tend not to finish them. And so she was saying that, hey, it's like a soap opera. You're like a soap opera. So she says, so just let your your viewers know that um, you have to wait for the next video to find out how the story ends. So <laughs> I thought that was super cute. So I'm like, yeah, I'm like a little soap opera. So I remembered what I wanted to tell you about um, the my husband. <laughs> I never finished that story. And I'm like, I watched the video going, oh. Well, hello, finish it. <laughs> so let me finish it for you. So I was just saying how we've gotten older and my husband likes to read. And he, um, he told, I'm gonna start with this side. He totally, um, now he can go into a store and, um, or actually he, he waits for me outside and he just reads his book. And so it's pretty darn cool that um, now I don't have to worry about him. Uh, Mama's in here, sorry, she's scratching. She's scratching herself. So. Um, where's my, oh, there it is. So she, um, <clears throat> he, um, will read now. And even if it's an hour, he's perfectly fine. And, you know, of course it's nice too that in this day and age we have smartphones. So he watches YouTube when he's waiting for me also. And that works out perfect. So that was the end of my story is that now he has patience in our older age. So pretty cool. These, um, these photos are, um, they're going to be really puppy heavy on this side because I really did not do anything this week and I, well, I mean, we, we did go out and we, we had an awesome week this week and, um, this week 10 and so I'm not really it was all good so I don't um, it's just a matter of I guess I didn't take that many pictures because we only did so much so oh shoot here come the gardeners <sighs> of course I've only been waiting all morning to do this to clean up my space and now I hear the gardeners which I needed to give them their payment and now I can't <laughs> so hopefully they're not here long, but then they're here long. <laughs> Does that make sense? Probably not. Okay, so let me go back to also this collection. This collection I absolutely loved because I don't know, it just screwed it. I turned around and I saw this collection in my six by six paper pad, and for some reason it screamed to me. I think because of my bling of my earrings that my husband bought me for my for our anniversary. And uh he, um, I like telling the story as I get to that site, so I'll wait. But, um, so I, I saw this collection. It's called, let me see, My Mind's Eye on Trend. Yeah, on Trend. So it's really gold heavy, and uh, I absolutely dig gold. And I've said that before in my videos. I do. They're, it's pretty cool. So, um... I, this collection just screamed to me that it needed to be used for this layout. So I'm glad I did because it was perfect. <laughs> I loved it. So let's see. No, I need this one to go down here. Do you see this picture? It's too funny. It's Cat. She's upside down. Well, she's sleeping. She sleeps upside down. And, uh, She's cute because, you know, when you have the bullies, they have the, the really big jowls. And so she, um, did I put that there? Mm, let me pull this one up. So she, um, all her jowls fall to the ground when she's upside down it's almost like you know like us as women you know when we lay down our boobs go you know what east to west <laughs> so that's how a bulldog is too and um so she uh she lays down mama and uh 
and so she looks super cute upside down. I love taking pictures of her like that. So, do I want that? No, I don't need it. I don't need it, don't want it. Says, this says, be your own kind of beautiful. And I think that's super cute. It came out really good. I love, I love how that, uh, making sure my head's not in the way like last time. I don't know how I did that. I did put the, the view a little closer. So hopefully that will work. I've been noticing my videos are getting a little bit longer than I'd like. And so I'm like, I got to pre-do some of these things because I don't want you guys. A 20, 20 minutes is good enough. Anything over 20, I get antsy. So <laughs> I'm like, I need to, you know, do my thing and then move on. So I will, I will try and do that a little bit more pre, pre-do, pre prep a little bit more and then I will um, sh I'll bring it up to the camera so you can see what um, what I did it says chocolate understands I made um, let me make sure I can see what I'm doing I made um, thin mint frosting over brownies as a treat uh, week 10 and <laughs> they were so good frosting is like the best. So, let's see. I love this collection. I didn't realize how much I actually collected of this collection until I started gathering stuff and sifting. Because remember, I told you I love sifting through my stuff. Every little sticker, I like looking. I like seeing what I have. I like it. It just relaxes me. So I have so much fun doing that. So as I was looking, I was like, oh hey, that's the, that's the collection. So. I was like, this is perfect, and um, I'll show you what I was excited about. This is You Are Loved, and then we are going to do an arrow. Whoops. See here, Mama, she's, she is awake, <laughs> so she's really loud right now. Whoops. Oh, good. It landed the right side. She's so cute. She's just a little cutie. She really is. We get a kick out of her. She is just like, she is, she's near blind. And uh, so she does a lot with her nose and with her sight. And uh, it is too cute because she's just, the, the look she has is just adorable when she's trying to figure out where you're at. And we clap our hands and we like to, um, let her know where we're at. So we'll go touch her and then she knows, she kind of knows my routine because I'm in my craft room like all day long. And so she loves being in here. And when we're gone, she, um, she just tends to go to, um, her bedroom, which is my son's room. And she waits until we get home. And then she's like, okay, I want to go in there. I want to go in the craft room. So, cause this is underneath my desk is I call them their little harem because they have all these blankets and pillows and memory foam that they won't leave the blankets on. So, you know, I put the memory foam on there really cute and or put blankets around the memory foam and they tend to scratch and make the blankets move. So I'm like, whatever. Make, you're all messy. They're like children, all messy. I'm gonna have to shut my office door. Of course, there's the gardeners. So, I'm telling you guys, it is just my luck. So hopefully it won't be too, too loud. Maybe I should just speak up, huh? I'll speak up. Last time the um, video cut out on me and I'm so glad that it kept filming though and it didn't stop because that would have been a bummer. Because I really don't know what the heck I'm doing. So I have to wait for my husband. And of course he went to work today. He started his tour. So he is gone. and So I would have to wait till tomorrow. If something goes wrong for him to fix it. <laughs> I'm like constantly. Will you fix it? Help me. So he does. He doesn't complain. So that's really good. Rocky here. He was. He was. I was cooking and he's like he was really tired and he really wanted to go to sleep but he was waiting for food to fall and so he's just like oh I want to sleep but oh I'm so tired and 
then he, he so he's in that in between that little bulldog stance they do and uh, where they sit and they're waiting and then so that's what he did so I'm like dude just fall asleep so he was cute okay so this is precious mama she was precious mama she was just sleeping and then this one you see that's cat She's in my armpit sleeping. It says, wonderful. It says, don't quit your daydream. And uh, so she was funny because she fell asleep. And uh, it looked like she melted. I'm like, it looks like you melted in my armpit. <laughs> so uh, I put deodorant on, darn it. So it's not like I killed her with the, <laughs> with the, the stench. Whoops, wrong one. And um, so... Um, so I was laughing though because her face is so funny and uh, so I put that on Instagram so but I put the um, rub on so that's what I wanted to tell you I did that ahead of time so um, and so we get to this side of the page my son who's 16 he'll be 17 in August he um, he got his driver's license he passed his test on the first try and we were shocked because my my you know boys are you know they learn different than girls do my daughter you know she she learned how to drive and then my husband taught her how to drive stick I believe every girl needs to learn how to drive stick um just for you know you never know right <laughs> so you never know when you're gonna be on like amazing race and you need to drive stick well that's my daughter she'll be able to do it but my son mm, no he can't do both and so um so he was a little bit slower in he's more cautious I guess I should say he yeah he thinks more he he has to evaluate stuff first before he does things which is good yes but at the same token it's like okay it's you know you you gotta go you gotta do this and so um so he got his driver's license and he came around that corner of the office after he um after he passed and he was ecstatic so he's like i did it <laughs> and i guess they're allowed to miss i want to say 15 i think it is and um on their on their the driving test with the with the person and he missed um six so that made me feel better too so we're on spring break right now and um i'm He's he was probably going to be going driving himself to school starting Tuesday, so that's a little scary and a little fun. He went by himself to his friend's house yesterday, and uh, that was his first time ever. And he did a good job, so we're like, Okay, his only problem is parking, and uh, so we got it. He has to learn how to park because that's the biggest thing. Because you know, at the high school parking lot, there's nothing but cars, and so he has to. He has to be able to navigate. He's like, oh man, I might hit a car. And we're like, no, you're not. You better not hit a car. So, yeah, geez. Dude, if you don't feel comfortable, don't go. And so he knows that. He knows if he's not, if he doesn't feel good enough to go, he won't drive. So, which is good. I don't want to take too long with these. So I'm going to just put them right here. Okay. And then, so my, my husband bought me these beautiful earrings for our for my anniversary he was just the sweetest and um we get to the i this is where i i bought he bought my wedding ring at the shane company and so we wanted to go get it cleaned so we walked in and he's just like he says um you know what pick out pick out a ring i've always wanted a ring back in the day i wanted a ring and so i was like mm, you know what i don't want a ring and he's like, no, pick out a ring. And I said, no. So he says, just humor me and try them on. So we went and I tried on the big ones. I tried on the small ones. And I'm like, nah. I said, I don't want one. I said, thank you though, but I really don't. And he's like, well, let's look at earrings. See, I always wanted you to have earrings because I don't wear anything, right? And so he's like, just do it for me. And I said, okay, fine. So I tried on... Um, a set of earrings they were too big they look too gaudy I don't like big and in your face kind of stuff so he's like okay we'll try these on and we saw them at the last minute and they were these they're little they're they're really really tiny but they're perfect for me because I'm like I don't want and I'm gonna write on here this is Tim's book I don't want anything big and so he knew that and so um, we went with that 
uh, we went with this one and so he was he was so excited that I that I did say okay I'll take these that man he's just funny but I'm like oh, he just did not want anything but he did and so I I haven't taken them off since. Once I put on my jewelry, I'm done. I have a ring. I have a necklace. That means a lot to me. And uh, now I have this beautiful set of earrings. So it was super sweet. So it was a good week. The same day. Um, was it the same day? I think it was the same day is when that happened where I got, um, where he passed his test. Yeah, I believe it's the same day. So it was like perfect. We were like having a really great day as a family. And uh, so it was cool. Simple week, but fun week. Okay, where are we at? 15 minutes. We're doing good, you guys. It says do more of what makes you happy. And that's, that's what we live by. Because it's like, you know, got to have fun with life. You really do. So these are my week 10 and I'm going to add some enamel dot. I'm going to show you real quick what I was, I think I, yeah, I took the, the sticky off of these. So this is going to say week 10, so the Scrabble sets from Thickers and so that is my week 10 pretty cool right you know all the gold it actually worked out really well you guys can see pictures on my blog and stuff so still pictures let me show you real quick before I go over my my limit so this is on trend six by six that was from that company I told you last week um, that had all that that great booth well look four dollars they had one section where it was all the latest and greatest and so this is where I got the six by six paper pad the ephemera pack and then this is the one I was talking about. If I can use most of it, I will. So look how much I've used of it. And I love it. And it still has plenty. So for me to do something else with. And then I have the enamel dots, which I'll put on these. So we're good. Oh, and I didn't show you this. So I put on the I Am um, little stickers. Enjoying the little things. And that's the rainbow. Because on when we went to the DMV, we were headed on home. And there was a rainbow. Full-blown all the colors and everything so that was cool it was good magic so <clears throat> I think we're good I think I'm gonna work on week 11 today so I'm excited and uh, I will have a swag bag video up here because uh, April's is out but um, which is available April 6th to you guys if you're not a subscriber so thank you guys very much I appreciate it we'll see you later bye